Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. I wanted to do a haul today on an Urban Decay order that I placed recently. And when I say recently, I'm going to give credit where credit is deserved because I purchased, I well, I placed this order on the 29th of February, which was this past Wednesday. And I placed the order like at three o'clock in the afternoon. I got a shipping confirmation the next day, which was yesterday, Thursday, at around 12 o'clock-ish. And today when I got home Friday, March 2nd, waiting for me at my doorstep was my order. So literally in less than 48 hours, I got I placed my order and got it. That is outrageous. So I'm going to say two thumbs up to Urban Decay and their shipping because that is incredible. And for those of you watching my video that you guys are subscribed to me and you're, you know, you stay tuned to what's going on with my videos, you're going to be like, didn't you say that in your last haul that you weren't going to do any more hauls, that you weren't going to buy any more makeup? I am going on a no buy and i officially started this no buy march 1st so i started it yesterday so i'm on day two and i'm gonna do it for a total of six months so i'm gonna be on a no buy all the way into the end of july so hopefully i can do it i know i can do it but i don't know it's gonna be super hard but i actually purchased these goodies on the 29th which means that I purchased it before my no buy. So this is the last haul that you're gonna be seeing from me for a while. And I think I got a great deal. So I wanted to share it with you guys cause I got a bunch of stuff and everything I'm gonna show you guys, my total with, I got free shipping, but my total with taxes and everything that I purchased came out to a whopping $78. And that is incredible, incredible, sorry, woo, for everything that I got. So let me get started so I can show you guys. The first thing that I purchased was the um, Urban Decay Book of Shadows 4 palette, which looks like this. I've actually seen this palette out. It's been out for a while, like a couple months now. But when it first came out, I was nowhere near interested in this palette. To me, it was super overpriced and it didn't draw in my attention big enough. You know what I mean? Like it wasn't a palette that I saw it and I was like, I gotta have it. As a matter of fact, the packaging was just like over the top for me. Like the whole concept of it just wasn't, I don't know, it just... I didn't like it and for $64 it was a lot of money and then they lowered the price to $44 and it still was a lot of money but I was actually on the internet on the 29th on Wednesday and I saw an advertisement saying that it was on sale for $29 so for $29 I'm going to pick it up so I picked it up and I put it in my shopping cart and if you guys haven't seen the book of shadows 4 it looks like this and the reason why I said I'm not crazy about the packaging because this is beautiful this is absolutely gorgeous, is you open up the flap, the first flap, and this is what you got, a bunch of nonsense, if you ask me. There's a little mirror here, a bunch of butterflies here. Don't get me wrong, it's beautiful. A bunch of butterflies here. It has like a little holder here, and this little holder serves the purpose that you're supposed to put your cell phone here because it's like a technology-based palette. You're supposed to be able to watch tutorials from your cell phone while you, you, while you do your makeup. So, I mean... I don't think I'm ever gonna use it like that, but it does come with everything for that. And right here, it comes with a little card and the little card has like a little, little things that you can scan to your phone and that's how the tutorials pop up. So, I mean, it's pretty. It's just like I said, over the top. And then down here is a little tray. I pulled it out so that it wouldn't um, fall out because I've already dropped it once. And this is what you're getting. Okay, you're getting over here. This is a USB cord that you connect your phone and a little speaker. This is a primer potion, which is of decent size. It's not super mini, but it's not the average size either. either. It's somewhere in between. This is a mascara, which I like the wand. I haven't tried it yet, so hopefully I could do a review for you guys if you like it. But this is the Urban Decay Super Curl Curling Mascara. And I wanted to show the wand to you guys. It's super cute. It's like curled really bend it up so i'm very curious to see how this one's going to work and it's not a very wet formula at least i just pulled it out and it doesn't look like it's a very wet formula so i'm very interested in trying that and this was the icing on the cake for me when i purchased this palette because this is a 24-hour liquid liner in the color perversion which is like their black is black and this alone this is full size and this alone is 19 dollars. so if you try to go get this liquid liner it's pretty much what the palette costs. I mean, 10 more dollars and you have all of this. So that's what really sold me on getting it for $29 because the colors are okay to me. They do have some nice colors 
Here are the 16 colors here. I like this blue over here in the corner. It's like a bluish purple. And this green is very pretty too. So I might try to do a tutorial on it. I mean, there's, they're not colors that are out of this world, but they're still very pretty. And we all know Urban Decay, their eyeshadow quality is really good. So you're still getting good quality with these um, eyeshadows here. And there's 16 of them. So you can't go wrong with this. So I got that palette. I'm excited about that because I'm excited about the price and everything that I got it for. So if there's a look or something you guys want me to do with that, let me know. I'll be more than happy to, you know, fill you in on any reviews or anything on that. I also grabbed this Urban Decay 24-7 Shadow Pencil Stash, which I found it to be a great deal. This originally was $34, and I got it for $12 on the website because, you know, of course, you want free shipping. That was $29, and I needed $50 in my cart, so I kept looking at whatever else was on sale, and I came across this, and a lot of people said great things about it. I haven't used it yet. I've never used one, but I hear you can use it alone. You can use it as a base, and it's very long-lasting. I actually swatched this one in the store once, which is the color, which is named Sin which is in the Naked palette, the original Naked palette, and it went on very vibrant. Like the color pigmentation is incredible and it lasted a while, so I believe it. And the one that I did see in Sephora was a little bigger than this and it was $20 and I got all of these for $12. And you're getting like a tealish blue and then you're getting this color Sin, you're getting two browns, a lighter one and then a darker one, and then you're getting a purple tone there. So I'm gonna definitely check these out and I'm gonna get back to you guys, but this was a great deal, $12. And of course, my card still wasn't at $50, so I went snooping around for some other stuff and I really wanted to get the 24-hour um, pencil in Woodstock, which is the very pink, like electric pink color, but that one pencil, is $19 and I found that to be a little ridiculous for one pencil so I started looking around I had put that in my cart and I took it out when I saw this this is actually a set of five travel size 24 7 pencils and it actually has the pink one I'm talking about right there which is the Woodstock beautiful pink and then you have perversion here which is like their black is black so this is the the liquid liner I just showed you in the palette this is the regular pencil in the same color and perversion. And then I get three more. I get Ransom, which is a purple. This is um, Radium, which is a nice pretty blue. And the last one over here is like a greenish, a dark green color, and it's called Junkie. So these are really cool also. I mean, I really wanted Perversion and Woodstock, and those two alone would have been almost $40 if I would have bought them in the regular size. And honestly, it's gonna take me a very long time to get through this, so, I don't even care that I got the travel size ones. This is great. So I'll get back to you back to you guys on this one also. So for $78, guys, I got five pencils, uh, five eyeliners, I mean, five of these shadow pencils, and I got a whole palette when the palette alone has a value of like $200. So I was really happy about that. I'm super excited because I'm not getting anything else. So I'm gonna enjoy, enjoy, enjoy what I have, and I'm gonna try to use up a lot of things. Um, if you guys are not subscribed, subscribe, subscribe, guys. I'm planning on doing a giveaway when I reach 200 subscribers. Right now, I'm at about 120, 110, 120. I'm not exactly sure. So thank you for everybody that has subscribed. You guys are a great support to me. And also, I'm going to be doing my next video is going to be a proposal. I'm thinking about doing these um not special kind of videos, but like a pattern, like a series of videos. So I wanted to get your guys' insight. So I want to know, you know, yay or nay, if I should do it if I shouldn't so I'm gonna put up that video so subscribe so you guys can give me your input on that as well and I'm gonna give you a heads up guys I'm not buying any more makeup okay but I do plan on buying the um the Vanity Girl Hollywood Mirror, if you guys have no idea what I'm talking about you guys need to like google it or go to their website it's um uh, vanity it's a van vanity girl Hollywood so I mean you guys can google it or you know look it up I actually noticed it on Emily Noel 83's channel her husband had bought it for her and I've had my eyes on it ever since it's like an outrageously beautiful like mirror and I mean it would just put the icing on the cake to my vanity because I have a mirror here and I have lighting but that's also the key because the the mirror that I'm talking about has six lights 
because I want to get the starlit one. And the starlit one is actually a tabletop one that has three lights on the left and three lights on the right. And I mean, it is just so beautiful. I had my eyes on it for the longest time. And the reason why I haven't purchased it is because it is $299 for the one I want. They have other ones, but that is actually the cheapest one, $299. And I've been wanting it for the longest time. And my husband promised me that with our income tax money, that I will be able to get that baby. So... I'm not getting it right now. I'm waiting till my income tax money comes in and stuff like that. But the minute I get some money, I'm going to be ordering that thing. So you guys will definitely be seeing a video on my mirror. So I'm not buying makeup, but that is kind of like, you know, makeup beauty related. But I've been wanting that for the past six months. So stay tuned also. Like I said, subscribe, guys, if you guys want to, you know, see the vanity mirror and check it out because it's definitely beautiful. And I know a lot of people have probably seen it and they've said, oh, I can make that. I've tried guys. I even went to like, I went to, um, like Home Depot and I bought mirrors and everything, not mirrors, um, lights and everything like that. And I bought bulbs and it's still like, I still feel like it's not enough light. So I definitely want to get that mirror because I think that it would just, like I said, it'll be the topping to my vanity. And if you guys want to see my vanity, my setup and stuff, my desk and everything, I got it at Ikea. Link it down below. I'll be more than happy to do a video on my area, but you're definitely going to see my area when I get my mirror. So thank you for watching guys. You guys are the best. Thank you for all the support and you guys have a great night. Take care.